This video is going to show the different options available for using an electric motor on your Aquaglide kayak or paddleboard. There are many lightweight electric trolling motors, power fins, and e-drive propulsion systems available that will work. Here we have some of the more popular motor options with Bixby, Torquedo, e-propulsion, Minn Kota, and Hikmar. Three main ways to mount your propulsion device include using the fin box, side mount transom, and stern mount. E-motors that attach to a US fin box are lightweight and easy to set up. Make sure that the fin drive you are considering is supplied with an appropriate fin box adapter. Simply screw the motor into the slot of the fin box, just like you would install a regular fin. Secure the battery in the back of the kayak or on the tail of the board, and then attach the waterproof cord to the battery and motor. The throttle is controlled with a Bluetooth wristband and steering is controlled with your paddle. The motor and lithium ion batteries combined weigh between eight and 10 pounds. Fin drives vary greatly from model to model in power, range, and functionality. They typically run around 70 to 90 minutes on full throttle, around five hours on half throttle, and much longer on the lowest setting. They range in price from $500 to $1,200. Side mount transoms clamp to an adapter plate or bar that extends out from the side of the kayak slightly behind the kayak seat, where steering can be easily controlled via the motor's tiller. Side mount adapters are widely available, including models from Brocraft and Railblazer. AG's Blackfoot Angler kayaks come ready to mount a side transom with universal mounts on the tubes. To add a transom onto other Duratex AG models, you will need to glue aftermarket universal mounts to the tubes. An entry-level trolling motor and deep cycle marine battery can be found for as little as $100 each. These motors offer more power and versatility than fin mount motors. The battery will typically weigh 50 pounds or more, but this may be a great option for those who already own a basic trolling motor and want to power their kayak. Lithium ion powered transom motors are much lighter and offer more range. These can cost $1,400 or more. Most have the ability to tilt and can be raised out of the water for launching and landing, accessing shallow water, and to clear the prop of weeds. Be aware that side-mounted propulsion comes with a degree of side-to-side -side torque that can make maintaining a direct line kind of tricky. Stern-mounted motors offer the best overall performance. They eliminate the lateral torque presented in side-mounting and tend to track better in the wind and current. Most importantly, they present the opportunity to adapt for hands-free steering. This is a game changer for fishing. AG's Blackfoot Angler kayaks come ready to mount a stern transom with universal mounts on the tubes. Stern mount transoms also require an adapter plate and mounting bracket. There are commercially available options or they can be self-fabricated. Some motors require proprietary mounting equipment. To take advantage of hands-free steering, you will be required to purchase and install rudder pedals and cables. This DIY project will take a weekend and cost significantly more than other options, but it will greatly enhance the Blackfoot as a fishing platform. The AG models that are acceptable to use with side or stern mounted trolling motors are only Duratex kayaks, including the Blackfoots, Chelans, Deschutes, and Mackenzies produced since the 2020 model year. Fin drive motors can be used on all kayak and SUP models with a US fin box. All of these models are approved for use with auxiliary propulsion up to a maximum of 0.75 kilowatts, 0.90 horsepower, up to 70 pounds of thrust. Some states and countries require boat registration when using propulsion of any kind. It is your responsibility to ensure compliance with all local, regional, state, and federal requirements. A manufacturer's assurance of propulsion compliance can be found on the Aquaglide website. We want to thank Hikmar, Torquedo, Bixby, and ePropulsion for providing motors for this video. We also want to thank Sealac Designs for providing rudder pedals and cables, Innovative Sportsman for the stern mounting plate, and Yak Attack for the switch pads used in rigging.